She's asking a question very dear to me. She's referring to someone who's a 74 year old, uh, active male uh, individual with a biochemical relapse after eight years with myeloma, being treated with daratumumab, revlimid, and dexamethasone, is now at the stage where they're on Dara every month. But is there a possibility to drop the dexamethasone for sake of quality of life? Well, the answer quickly is yes, absolutely. This is part of what I call the down with dex movement. As we're both seeing this in the clinical trials that we're designing and in the clinic, that we can use less dexamethasone. Dexamethasone is a great drug. It really helps, especially when we initiate treatment because it boosts other drugs to tackle myeloma. It sometimes can reduce administration reactions like we have with the Dertumab or Darzalex here. It can reduce pain and sometimes even nausea. But with time, its positive effect is less and its negative effect grows because it can affect people's blood sugar and blood pressure and mood and sleep patterns and weight and a whole host of things. So very often what we find is we start with dexamethasone for the first few months, then we taper it down. And I can tell you in my practice, the vast majority of patients are off dexamethasone by about six months. So this is something, uh, Helga, to be discussed with the healthcare provider here, that there really is an opportunity to turn down the dose and indeed to discontinue.